the very latest in agricultural equipment technology on display each year at the Farm Science Review 2017. No different, Gehringhoff putting on display their industry-leading combine head technology. Scott Brown of Gehringhoff tells us more. What we're going to show you today is uh, we've got our new TrueFlex razor. This razor is really revolutionary to uh, the grain harvesting industry from a standpoint of just having the flexibility uh, and some features that nobody else is able to offer at this time. As we look at our other competitors in the marketplace, uh, where we differentiate ourselves is when we talk at a TrueFlex razor, we talk about the flexibility that's built into this head. A lot of our competitors either have a rigid back frame and a flexible front frame. What we've been able to do is have both pieces. We've got a flexible back frame and a flexible front frame. So we're kind of taking the best parts of all the heads that are out there and combining them into one good head. So we'll start here on the center drive. We've got this center drive system that is hydraulically driven. It's got a pressure sensor uh, relief on it. So if we would happen to get something caught up in here between the knife and the guard, uh, it'll stop the cutter bar without breaking knives and breaking guards. But this center drive We've got a very clear view coming down off the cab. We can see what's going on. As you go down, as you look at this transition that comes up across when we go from the knives up onto the belt, this is a very smooth transition. Some of our competitors have a much steeper incline or a much longer transition up onto that belt. We get the crop from the knives up onto the belt in a, in a short period of time without a lot of, uh, of incline or transition to, to get them up there. One thing that we do have that we're going to offer on this head is an integrated air system. The crop will get stuck in this transition or, or we'll lose beans. That air just keeps a constant air flow, flow keeping that crop flowing up onto your belt and giving you uh, every advantage to get that crop and those beans that might shatter out of the pods during that transition period up onto that belt and eventually into your bin. As we go around the head, these real narrow dividers at the ends, certainly one of the advantages of our center drive system. Uh, again, it slices through the crop, uh, doesn't knock much down in real tight, uh, heavy population or tangled, twisted crops. As we step back and look at this reel, uh, we've got this three section reel. When you look at this head from the combine, when you're, standing, when you're sitting in the combine operating this machine, all of our competitors uh, that have a split reel, the split is right at the center of the head. So their split system uh, you're looking at it all day. You're looking at two reel ends coming together uh, right in the center. Our machine, when you sit in the cab, you've got a clear view looking down right into your center section. A lot of the guys that have bought these heads or had a chance to run these heads have commented the visibility of this head, that this head provides them over the competitive heads that are out there is tremendous. They have a much better view of that center section uh, where their drive system is, where the, where the feeder drum is, and where that center belt system is. It just gives you a much cleaner view uh, all day long instead of sitting there looking at a split reel all day. Okay, as we look at the back side of this head, again, it's where we set ourselves apart from most of the competitors on the market. We do have, on either side of the feeder house, we do have a hinge point that allows our wings to flex uh, up and down. We've got 12 inches of, of flex up and down out here at the end uh, on this wing. But the thing that really sets us apart is we don't use a big center adapter. We've got our head mounts directly to the combine just like a normal flex head would. And then we use this torsion spring, the big bar that comes down, it's got a torsion spring inside it and that helps us balance our head side to side. When you look at our gauge wheels, they're standard. That gauge wheel is tied into the automatic header control system. So there are sensors out on our runners underneath this head that are telling this gauge wheel what to do. So if they encounter an obstacle out front or a drop off in the field, it's gonna tell the hydraulic system and the electronic system on this head to raise and lower that gauge wheel to follow the contour of that field. Just an advantage that nobody else offers. Most heads are, have an optional gauge wheel we make ours standard and we integrate it fully into the header control system. Uh, little things that we've done that made a big difference for the operators that ran them last year was we put an after LED aftercut and LED cut lights that shine both behind and out in front on the corners of this head. 
It sounds little, but it's something that when, as soon as it got dark and we turned those lights on, uh, the guys just, their face just lit up. They're saying, wow, I can actually see the end of, ends of my 40 foot heads now. I didn't even know they were out there when I was running uh, the competitor head. So just little things like that that we've done to try to make that whole experience better for the operator. We know they're spending long days in the fields and uh, we want to make that the best experience possible for them. What we found is, found in our research and, and our development of this head, the ability that this head has to flex the, the contours of the ground really does uh, allow you to get more beans per acre up off the ground and into the combine and, and in eventually into your bin. Um, the flexibility that this thing has is unmatched by any other head that's out there. We invite you to come see us at the Ohio Farm Science Review next week. Uh, the Draper head, the TrueFlex razor that here behind me will be running in the field each day on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday at the infield demos. Uh, please come see us at our lot. You're welcome to come visit us out at, the, out at the field during the live demos. The other thing we will be showcasing next week at the Farm Science Review is our new Freedom corn head. It's our 15-inch row corn head uh, designed to harvest both 30 and 15-inch corn uh, rows. Uh, designed kind of for that customer that's thinking about transitioning from 30 inch corn to maybe something narrower, uh, but it's a, a nice option. So that, that head will also be running in the field. The Ohio Farm Science Review team here has uh, actually been very generous and planted us 15 inch corn to harvest all three days with the Freedom Head. So please come see us for that as well.